This is PSPY simulation series. In previous video of AC sweep analysis, we have created a clipper circuit using PSPY's component libraries. In this video, we'll create simulation profile and we'll learn how to run AC sweep analysis on this clipper circuit. So let's get started. In the first step, we are going to open previously created project, which you can download using the link given in the description. Then you can go to Cadence program menu and select ORCAD capture. Then from the Cadence CIS product choices, I'm going to select which license I'm going to use for this project and click over OK. Once the ORCAD capture is ready, we are going to open the existing project. To do that, go to File, Open, Select Project. You have to browse to the location where you have downloaded the project file. In my case, it is in the desktop. Select the Clipper Circuit.opj file and click over Open button. Once the project is open, we are going to open the schematic. To do that, we'll go to schematic and double click here. Once the project is open, we are going to add voltage probes on AC in, DC in, mid node and out node of this clipper circuit. To do that, we have couple of options. First option is we can place voltage probe directly from this button. If you can't see voltage probes in this section, you can just go to P spice go to the markers and from here you can place voltage probes. So I'm going to place those quickly. Just hold the control key, zoom in. So first I'm going to place on DC, VAC, mid node. If you have not assigned any net label here, you can assign it or you can just place this probe here without assigning any net name. And we are going to add another probe at the output of this clipper circuit. That's it. Right click and end mode. Once we have assigned all the voltage probes, in the next step, we are going to create new simulation profile for this project. To do that, we'll click over new simulation profile button. I'm going to name it AC sweep and click over create button. Once we'll do that, simulation setting window will open. Here we can see couple of options. We are going to do AC sweep analysis in the logarithmic scale. So make sure you have selected logarithmic. After that, we are going to add start, end and points per decade. So start frequency in our case will be 10 Hertz. So let's mention 10 Hertz here. End frequency will be 100 megahertz. So we'll mention 100 meg. In our case, I'm going to add number of points per decade 11. Now, if you are wondering what is the meaning of decade here, so it is a unit of measurements in the log scale, which means simulation will record the data points 11 per decade. And here one decade correspond to log 10, which means the ratio of input and output will be 10, right? So next we'll click over apply and OK. Now in the next step, we are going to run the simulation. To do that, we'll click over run simulation button. Now we'll open simulation plots. And here we can see we have V in, which is a DC voltage here. Then we have AC voltage and the middle and output voltage. Similarly, you can play along with this clipper circuit, change couple of parameters and see if you are getting the expected results or not. Next in this, we are going to do Bode plot. To do that, we'll double click over V out and here we'll get this modified trace window. Now here, instead of V out, we are going to use DB V out function and click over OK. Here we go. So here we have plotted Bode plot for clipper circuit. As you can see on the X axis, we have frequency and on the Y axis, we have gain. So that's it for this AC sweep analysis. Next, we are going to save this project. To do that, we'll go to file and click over save button. For more tutorials, visit us at resources.emaeda.com and don't forget to like and subscribe our YouTube channel.